I'm going to present the engineering week of class 8B for 2024-2025. As a part of engineering week, the students of our class work together on three projects. We were creating Heron's Fontaine, a tent security tower and a night light with flowers. These projects demonstrate interesting physics rules. Heron's Fontaine operates on the principle of hydropneumatics. Under the influence of air and liquid, water is pushed upward in a jet. Its operation is based on the interaction of three containers placed at different levels. Three groups worked on this project, one of which focused on creating a Pertio Fontaine, using two containers and two tubes of different sizes and volumes. It's neither elementary nor professional level, but so exciting. Tensegrity Tower At 32, Richard Buckmeister Fuller was broke and unemployed. Before that, he had been kicked out of Harvard twice. One day, he asked himself an interesting question. Does humanity have a real chance to survive and succeed on Earth? And if so, what can one ordinary person do that big organization, corporation or even governments cannot? He spent the rest of his life trying to answer this question and achieved a lot. He wrote 28 books and created ideas like Spaceship Earth, Ephemalization and Sand Guarantees. He also invented many things, mostly in design and architecture. His most famous invention is geodesic dome, a strong, lightweight structure made of metal rods. Some of his ideas, like tensegrity structure, are still waiting to be used more widely. The tensegrity tower shows a balance between pushing and pulling forces. Hard parts are hanging on tight strings and don't even touch each other. The tower stays strong only because all parts are pulling and pushing the right way. This tensegrity tower was made by Mikola Klovsky, main material wood, and other one, Yeva Presezhnik, made of plastic. Both projects show how simple physics can create amazing effects. A night light called Endless Tulip Field this night light creates the effect of endless space using mirrors and LED lights, turning ordinary flowers into a magical illusion of infinity. We twist wire to make a tulip, forming a 2-2.5 cm stem, where we apply glue in a mirror and stick on the tulips, followed by stones and petals, we placed corner supports at the bottom of the mirrors. Next, we add the side mirrors to form a cube and connect the power source. Turn it on and enjoy the soft, pleasant light and the work of our own hands. These projects show how simple physical principles can create impressive mechanical and optical effects. During engineering week, we explored, experimented, designed and finally we created. Our students show creativity, passion and real teamwork. Thank you for your attention. It will be continued.